look at another few important verses from Surah An-Namal, wherein Allah Ta'ala has said, أَمَّنْ خَلَقَ السَّمَوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضَ Or who is it that has created the heavens and the earth? وَأَنزَلَ لَكُمْ مِنَ السَّمَاءِ مَاءً And he has sent down for you from the heavens water, meaning rain. فَأَنْبَتْنَا بِهِ حَدَائِقَ ذَاتَ بَهْجَةٍ And we have brought forth as vegetation from that water gardens that are beautiful, gardens of beauty. مَا كَانَ لَكُمْ أَن تُنْبِتُوا شَجَرَهَا And it was not that you could have ever brought forth its vegetation. أَإِلَاهٌ مَعَ اللَّهِ Is there a deity worthy of worship along with Allah? بَلْ هُمْ قَوْمٌ يَعْدِلُونَ Nay, they are a people who are adverse to justice or they go away from justice. أَمَّنْ جَعَلَ الْأَرْضَ قَرَارًا Or who is it that has made the earth a place of residence? وَجَعَلَ خِلَالَهَا أَنْهَارًا And he has made throughout it rivers. وَجَعَلَ لَهَا رَوَاسِيَ And he has made for it, for the earth, its rawasi, its mighty mountains, its large mountains. وَجَعَلَ بَيْنَ الْبَحْرَيْنِ حَاجِزًا And he has made between the two oceans, meaning between the two water types, a hajj is a barrier. أَإِلَاهٌ مَعَ Allah. Is there a deity that is worthy of worship along with Allah? Of course, a rhetorical question. The answer is, of course not. بَلْ أَكْثَرُهُمْ لَا يَعْلَمُونَ Rather, most of them do not have knowledge. أَمَّنْ يُجِيبُ الْمُضْطَرَّ إِذَا دَعَاهُ Or who is it that answers? He responds to the one who is in distress when he calls upon him. وَيَكْشِفُ السُّوءَ And he removes the hardship or the difficulty or the evil things. وَيَجَعَلُكُمْ خُلَفَاءَ الْأَرْضِ And the one who has made you to be generations one after the next upon earth. أَإِلَاهٌ مَعَ Allah. Is there a deity worthy of worship along with Allah? قَلِيلًا مَا تَذَكَّرُونَ Very little is it that you think and reflect. Then Allah says, أَمَّنْ يَهْدِيكُمْ فِي ظُلُمَاتِ الْبَرِّ وَالْبَحْرِ Or who is it that guides you throughout the layers of darkness on earth and at sea? وَمَنْ يُرْسِلُ الرِّيَاحَ بُشْرًا بَيْنَ يَدَيْ رَحْمَتِهِ And who is it that sends forth the winds as glad tidings before the arrival of His mercy? أَإِلَاهٌ مَعَ اللَّهِ Is there a deity worthy of worship along with Allah? تَعَالَ اللَّهُ عَمَّا يُشْرِكُونَ Exonerated and far above be Allah above all the things that they associate with him. Then Allah says, أَمَّنْ يَبَدَأُ الْخَلْقَ ثُمَّ يُعِيدُهُ Or who is it that has created the creation and then he returns it? وَمَنْ يَرْزُقُكُمْ مِنَ السَّمَاءِ وَالْأَرْضِ And who is it that provides for you from the heavens, from above, and from the earth below you? أَإِلَاهٌ مَعَ Allah. Is there a deity? Worthy of worship, along with Allah, قُلْ هَاتُوا بُرْهَانَكُمْ إِن كُنْتُمْ صَادِقِينَ Say to them, O Muhammad, bring forth your proof, bring forth your evidence, if you are indeed truthful. And these verses are verses number 60 to 64 from Surah An-Namal.